Hey everybody, this is Grow It, Build It. I'm going to show you how to remove rust using citric acid. Recently I came into possession of several old rusty seized up hand planes and I wanted to restore them a bit, knock the rust off and make them presentable and usable for myself. And uh, I researched it quite a bit. I got a detailed article on our website, growitbuilder.com, as to why I chose citric acid as opposed to evaporust, uh, electrolysis, vinegar, all that. But get yourself some citric acid, shop towels, WD-40, protective gloves, a toothbrush, a stiff bristle brush, and a tub to hold everything. Now the citric acid is going to dissolve the rust through a chemical reaction. Um, so I started by disassembling my hand planes, uh, just getting down to the metal parts only. Um, and anyways, once I did this, I took the WD-40 and cleaned up the parts quite a bit. Um, I do this just to uh, remove any barriers of grease, grime, oil, on the metal because that would act as a barrier uh, between the metal and the citric acid solution which is basically water but once you've uh, done all this and cleaned them up quite a bit you need to make your solution so get uh, hot water and put in a quarter cup to a half cup of the citric acid and mix it up well um, once you've mixed it up well and you're uh, confident that you've got enough or think you do you basically just dip your parts in and leave them there in about 15 minutes or so, you should be able to go in and start to see uh, some little bubbles forming. And I did scrub them right after I put them in. Just again, I'm trying to remove any possible barriers between the solution and the metal. But there's a good shot of the little bubbles. That's what you want to see. If you don't see that within 15, 20 minutes, you don't have enough acid in there. You need to add more. Um, I leave them in there for about 30 minutes to an hour. I'd pull them out and scrub them a little bit. The surface rust goes away right right away quick. Uh, the deep rust takes longer. I wouldn't leave them in there more than a couple hours though because this solution will pit the metal eventually. Um, so just kind of you know do it. Once you're done, dry them immediately and coat them in oil. I used 3-in-1. You could use mineral oil, but overall I was very pleased with the results. Uh, they looked totally very much much better than when they started um, but again our website growupbuilder.com will have a detailed article on why we did this and uh, more info on how you can do it so I hope you enjoyed it thank you guys very much